Hi, I'm Richard from Drive Green and today we're going to be taking a look at rapid charging your electric car at a Genie Point charge point. This video follows on from our public charging guide video where we run through in detail and explain how to public charge your EV and make journey charging stress and problem free. Please be sure to also check out this video on our YouTube channel. Genie Point has a large network of charge points that combine uh, a couple of rapid charging connections as well as a slower AC fast charger. It's possible to use the fast charger as well as a rapid charger, but you can't use two rapid chargers simultaneously. Uh, the rapid chargers, of course, are the ones you'll be using when you're going on a long drive, and it's the rapid charger we're going to be plugging into today. They have some good locations and always seem to be very convenient whenever we go on holiday, and they can also be found at most Morrison supermarkets. To pay for and to start your Genie Point Rapid Charge, you need to use the Genie Point app. Uh, alternatively, on some of the charge points, you can use a Genie Point RFID card. Some of the newer Genie Point Rapid Chargers do also now accept contactless card payment. But the first thing you'll need to do is download the Genie Point app and register. You then need to store a credit card in the app, which is then used to top up your available charging balance that is required to pay. You can initiate charging using either the app or the RFID card. If you want to use the RFID card, you'll need to send off for one in advance because it can take about a week to arrive. But once you've got the RFID card, you can operate the charge point in a contactless fashion. And you can order one through the app in the My Account section. To put a balance on your app so you can pay for your rapid charging, go to My Account in the app, click Top Up, and then the amount you wish to add. You will need to add a credit card into the app to do this, which you do in the Payment section. To start your charge, you press the start stop button and then you'll select the connector you're going to be using that matches your car. Um, if you're using the RFID card, just present it against the screen uh, like a contactless card. It will authenticate. And then you can remove your connector and plug it into your car. To stop charging, if you're using the RFID card, you press the start stop button on the screen. Then you select the connector that you wish to disconnect and then you press stop charge and again using the RFID card just place it against the screen. If you are using the app open it, click on the location you want to charge at, select the connection you will be using on your car, then click start charging in the app and plug the cable in. To stop charging simply press the stop icon in the app, remove the cable and return it to its harness. The Genie Point network is a good one, particularly if you're doing a lot of long distance driving and you need to rapid charge. It's definitely worth having the Genie Point app set up on your phone. Uh, and if you think you might be using the Genie Point network a lot, then I think it's actually probably worth having the RFID card as that does make things even simpler. I hope this short video has been helpful in explaining how to use a Genie Point rapid charger. If you'd like to find out more about rapid charging or you have any questions about living with an electric car in general, please be sure to get in touch. Please also be sure to watch our in-depth uh, public charging video, uh, as well as our other uh, how-to videos on the other charging networks on our YouTube channel. Thank you very much for watching.